all right so what's up guys and today in this video we have the all new iphone 14 pro leather case which is the official case from apple itself so i did pre-order the iphone 14 pro and the apple watch series 8 so if you want me to review your accessories feel free to send it out to me i'll be happy to review them uh, but yeah this is the uh, apple leather case i also have the iphone 13 pro leather case here so we'll be comparing how the materials are and what the color is uh, of the case itself so yeah let's quickly unbox um the uh, case itself oh we don't have the uh, the pull tab do we this year i don't think so so we just pull oh yeah we just pull all right damn this is a good color this reminds me of the iPhone 12 leather case, which was a darker shade of leather as well. Uh, I hated the fact that this was a lighter shade of the leather color because this one patina is real good, while this took a lot of time to actually show patina. But yeah, this is the case. We'll just take it out of the box real quick. We also have some documentation here that of course no one's gonna read, so I'll keep it aside. But yeah, this is the case itself, as you can see, uh, and this is the iPhone 13 Pro case. Um, as you can see, we do have a bit of a difference here. This one is a darker shade. This one is a lighter shade. As you can see on the sides, we do have a little bit of a patina. I, I hardly use this case. I had like 10 cases for the 13 Pro, so I kept switching them. But yeah, so we'll quickly check out what the differences are. Again, on the side, as you can see, we have the power button itself on top there's nothing on this side as you can see we have both the volume rockers and the alert slider and then on the bottom everything is the same so the phone is actually the same there's no difference between 13 pro and the 14 pro in terms of dimensions but as you can see inside everything's the same so what i'll do now is i'll put my my phone my 13 pro here in this case which is the official leather case and as you can see it fits perfectly fine and the cutout is fine as well and yeah this is this is perfect so now i'll just take it out real quick i'll keep it aside now i'll put it on the 14 pro case and let's see what the difference is so it fits perfectly as you can see we did not get the magsafe thingy for some reason but i promise you this this is the official case itself so yeah again as you can see if i unlock it real quick if i just turn it down here as you can see we do have a major camera difference so in this particular case as you can see we have a lot of space for the camera which of course tells us that there has been an improvement in the camera itself and also the bulge is going to be uh, massive than the 13 pro so what i'll do is i'll take this off real quick as well and what we'll do now is we'll compare the camera uh, bulge here there we go as you can see we do have a bit of a difference in the uh, camera protection which again suggests that there is going to be a massive difference in terms of the camera but yeah other than that the case is the exact same uh, i also have more cases from different brands that i will be reviewing once i get the iphone 14 pro in my hands which is september 16th and i am picking it up from the fifth Ave apple store in new york so yeah i'm pretty excited for that as well but yeah if you have any questions regarding this case uh, feel free to put them down in the comment section uh, i'll also be making another video when my 14 pro arrives uh so yeah stay tuned for that as well but yeah for now that is pretty much it thank you for watching again if you have any questions any concerns put them down in the comment section and i'll be happy to reply to you guys but yeah thank you for watching this video if you like this video give it a big thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll catch you guys in the next one